Hi, Connor Rolls here from Bunny Animation Studios bringing you a Photoshop tutorial. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start doing Adobe tutorials because I have all the, like, I have the Creative Cloud and I actually know how to use everything pretty well. So, yeah. Anyways, we're going to get right into this tutorial. This is a color replacement tutorial because it's important. So, let's get right into it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to change this whole picture to black and white and then change a few colors in this. Now, there's a couple of ways to do this, but we're going to start by image adjustments, black and white. Now, the reason I didn't use the adjustment palette over here and click black and white is it just doesn't work that way because that's it. It gives it an adjustment layer. This changes the actual image of the background to that color to black and white so we're gonna take out this uh the cyan's a little bit but not too much because i know that this ball back here actually blends in a little bit if i take out too much of the cyan's or however you say it i don't know how to say it. i just call it cyan's or cyan's anyways so once we got that we're gonna do the quick select tool quick select tool is a fabulous thing that makes it so you can quickly select something just like that bada bing bada boom now the quick select tool isn't always perfect like out here we got a little bit of extra stuff and we'll sort that out here in a second so we're gonna select the entire ball and then we do have this little bit here if i zoom in you can see that it's kind of selecting this 12 here so if you press alt you'll see that little plus sign go to a negative sign and we'll brush over it and it gets rid of that then we're going to click Control J. What that does is everything in the selection, it will create a new layer, saving only what is in that selection. So for example, that ball was in this selection, so that's what's going to be saved in that new layer. For those that don't know Photoshop that well, this is your layer palette. So if I want to switch which way everything is, that's where I would do it over here. Now it's really not going to matter in this image because nothing is moving. But you can hide and show each layer here over here. So that's what's important, I guess. Anyways, if I hide the background layer, you can see that the number one ball is the only ball on the table. Now, next we're going to take our... It's, not, it's in the brush. We're going to take our color replacement tool, which is under the brush tool. So if you left click and hold and then there is the color replacement tool and then let go of our mouse while it's over that we're going to change this specific ball to red and you just brush over that ball and bada bing bada boom it's red fabulous right Next, we're going to go and do it to this ball, and this ball is going to be green, so we're going to quick select it. And that seemed pretty painless and easy to do because it doesn't look like it's bleeding over anywhere. So we're going to click Control J, take our brush tool, or you can press B, um, W for the quick select, so, or B for the brush tool. Um, and then we're going to do green. And I guess it could be a lime green. I mean, you're not going to get that perfect color of green, mostly because you are color replacing. Now, this just gave me a perfect example of what to do if you have this leakage, but you don't want to go all the way back and fix it. So what you're going to do is just take your eraser and scrub those edges off. So that's my finished goal. That was my goal for this image. Really easy. That took me less about five to six minutes. It took me less than six minutes to do and talk to you guys at the same time. So there's no excuse for you to get bad. Anyways, if you want to see more Photoshop tutorials and Adobe tutorials, go ahead, like this video and comment. Also, go to our website, bunnydomination02.webnote.com. Tell us video ideas and things you want to see in Photoshop done, or Premiere, or After Effects, and we can take it from there. Anyways, thanks for watching.